So yeah, uh, 2020 hasn't been the best year, so we uh, decided we're going to build a hot rod. So this project started because I've always wanted a hot rod, but you know, didn't fancy getting an actual 32 Ford because it was one. Cash money. <laughs> yeah. And um, so basically we yeah, worked out that having an old styled car with modern modern uh, mechanic and stuff is probably the best way to go for it. You're supposed to build a hot rod, that's the whole thing. Like hot rods are supposed to be built in your garage or your shed. You could buy a 32 Ford for a lot of money or for over half, less than half the price, build your own replica that's faster, more reliable, better on fuel, drives nicer and has more comfort. The 32 sedan has the rear tailgate which makes it the most practical for a daily drive of a car and, yeah, you, and you've got three doors but it's also these sort of estate shape so you can carry your camera and video gear in or or people. Or, or, or people, yeah. Or people. So I said I wanted a hot rod, then Tom did a sketch and then I did a 3D model and yeah, that's basically how we designed it. After having a look at a few cars, here's the one we settled on. Well, we chose this rental by accident. <laughs> well, accident slash coincidence. It happens to have the same wheelbase, plus or minus an inch or two, of a 32 Ford. Same stud pattern. And slot, fairly similar track width. I mean, yeah, it's four wheel drive, but that doesn't matter. You can convert that to two wheel drive. Ooh. And it's a separate, a separate frame to body car, so you can just take the body off and put another body on. Well, the basic plan is take the Kia, pull the body off, and fit the 32 body. Sounds a lot more simple than it's going to be. Damn it, cat! <laughs> um. The aim is to keep the spend as sort of, you know, what can you build for 10 grand? Ow! It's my leg. The Kia Sorento we've got 2005 with 150,000 miles on it, but the chassis is straight, it runs quietly, and it's pretty tight mechanically. So, we've got the car, we've got the body, we've just got to get them both together. We'll post updates when we can, so you can follow our progress. The next video should be coming soon.